ran to the basement and it was just a um, matter of like 30 seconds that but we could hear it. Sharon Schaefer took a few pictures of the storm seconds before it hit. Her son was screaming, get into the basement. The way it was spinning across that field and it built, I, I watched it kind of build as it was coming toward us. Moments later, they came out and couldn't believe their eyes. Looked out and saw our big barn all collapse and I cried. The barn looked like a bunch of matchsticks. Twisted metal spread for a quarter mile. Even the neighbor down the street found his trampoline in the Schaefer's field. We come out, it was like all done. You just can't believe it. Something could be so devastating in such a short time. The wind was so strong that it lifted this silo off its pad, but family, friends, and neighbors all banded together and helped in the cleanup efforts. The farming equipment in the barn had very minor damage and no one got injured. Oh, I like watching storms. <laughs> and I, I could be a storm watcher, I think. <laughs> so I just wanted to see what it looked like. All this. Buildings and machinery don't mean much. You know, you look at them poor people in Joplin, Missouri, they're dealing with a cleanup plus, you know, they could be putting a loved one to rest. So we don't have to do that and thank God for that. In Huron County, Gary Abrahamson, News Channel 5.